breakfast of the champions. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to not sunny Brussels. We have some interesting stuff to do today. Red and Racing in Belgium and uh, as you can see behind is the fully new 992 Cup car which is the car I will be using this season in the Carrera Cup Benelux and uh, yeah we are here meeting the team first time it's nice to see all the all the people checking the car and uh, and as you can see we are making a seat mold for me also and uh, then we have also simulator today for braking technique of the car which is quite special on this um, and then tomorrow we have the first shakedown of the car so tomorrow morning we get to drive the car it's gonna be interesting few days there is not much what I can say to you about the car because I'm not not an expert I, I have seen the car first time today and seen a car like this overall first time today but it's quite similar to rally car Symbol, let's say, buttons on the steering wheel, what you need, like radio, lights, stuff for the dashboard, you can change, I think you can change ABS and traction control if you use them, but in our series, what I will be driving, we don't use ABS and traction control, so there is no driving assist at all, which will be, of course, the purest form of driving, but yeah, quite simple, looks like a proper race car, so that's nice. One thing what was quite interesting, because I think the car has like a normal style pedal position, so they come from the top, it's not like pedal box from the ground like we have in a rally car, so they are quite far to the right. I'm used to have my legs fully straight when I sit, and now I have them quite on the right, so that's quite interesting. Will be a different feeling having the pedals and legs on the right side of the cockpit compared to the seat. Other than that, all good. Need to drive it to tell you more. So as you can see, the, the mold is now almost done. The seat position on these cars is fixed um, on the rails. So you can move it front and back, but you cannot tilt it or change the height or anything. So um, I would want the tilt to be a bit different, but we're gonna change it. So we need to try to do everything with the mold as best we can. Try to put my position on the best, best way what I want. Um, but it seems to be quite good now. So that's done. The car looks really good. Nice to always see a new, new race car. Looks beautiful. Everything is fresh and new, so I try to keep it in a good position also tomorrow when, when we drive it. Cool looking car, really nicely done, so cannot wait to drive it.
So now our sim session is done. Um, I could drive a bit of sandboard and solder also. It was quite interesting. Um, the feeling in the sim was uh, was good. It was quite uh, easy to, to get hang of the, the simulator, even though I didn't drive this one before. So the feeling was really nice. Um, the main point was to see how I brake with the car and to see the driving style, if it's uh, close enough. We had a Rudy here, um, he's a professional on these things, on the simulator, and also he has driven a lot of the cup car. So he was a good reference point to set some data for me and check the data with me and, and the lap times and stuff. We didn't really focus too much on how to quick to be, but how to drive the car. And, and at least he said that I was in a good area. So I felt I was quite happy how I was driving. Normally for me, it's easier on the real car than in the sim. So if I did quite okay in the sim, I'm sure tomorrow should be quite fine. I'm really looking forward for it. So let's see tomorrow what we do. First one now with the car is done. Um, as you can see, I'm smiling. Uh, really, really cool to be now finally in the car. Definitely exciting. Quite, uh, let's say, cold in the morning, the track, not, not too much grip. And we are, of course, used tires now because we are just doing shakedown for the car. Um, but yeah, a few, few a bit faster laps in. Uh, the, the car is definitely fun to drive. Also, I can imagine it's quite difficult when starting to, to push for the last things, but first feeling is good, car is working well and the guys check everything is now fine and we go soon again.
the morning session is now done. It went quite well. We just basically checked that the car is working fine from the data point of view. It was a completely new car, so first drive today. Um, I think the driving was uh, was quite quite good. We are driving with used set of tires, so the lap times are quite okay. Still, at least in the morning, there was some curbs and stuff still uh, still wet also from the night. So not the easiest conditions, let's say, but still going quite well. Uh, I'm quite steady, just trying to get a hang of the car, how it works. This is quite special car to brake, like I said before. So no ABS or anything. The front is quite light, so easy to to lock up the the inside wheel if you are turning same time than braking. So that has been, let's say, the biggest thing for me to learn how to brake with the car and, and to be gentle enough on, on the brakes um, when going into the turns. So yeah, we've had some good runs, let's say. I think the feeling and everything is quite good. The guys also said that the data and everything seems to be on the right area at least. We have still one more session um, this afternoon. I'm having a really busy schedule, like many times. Um, I will still do one session in the car and then I will go straight to the airport for a flight, so it's gonna be still interesting afternoon and let's let's try to learn everything we can. done here in, in Solder. Um, really positive and nice feeling. First time being in the cup car. The day went well. We didn't do much uh, of work with the car or anything setup wise. Just getting me used to the car. Um, trying to find our setups for me. Brake balance, some mapping things. Small, small things because uh, this car is, is uh, I would say, more about drive, driver and driving than, than the small things what we can do on the setup than in the races. Really positive day. I would say meeting the team was was also positive. Um, everybody at uh, at Red Ant feels really professional. I like the style how they work also, um, focusing on the on the things that are important and, and uh, the driver is is just driving. So uh, that was really nice to see. So hopefully you liked the video, seeing a bit behind the scenes when we are preparing for the circuit racing season. It's gonna be next time totally different challenge being in the first race of the season uh, with the cars on the track trying to push on uh, on the qualifying for the fast lap so it will be a big challenge but uh, at least now I had a really positive feeling and, uh, and good feelings for the first race.